Hello everyone, welcome back to the vlog. I just got home from work and I'm feeling pretty tired, but we have a lot of D23 prep to do in this vlog. And for some reason, I just feel like right now is the perfect time to do it, even though I'm so tired. It's currently Monday and we leave Thursday morning at 7 a.m., which I actually had to change my flight last minute because I originally was going to be leaving at like 11.30, which is like my ideal flight time because I get to sleep in a little bit. But we received an email that we have to check in, get like our D23 passes and stuff. 7 a.m. flights are not my friend and I somehow need to look presentable at 7 in the morning. Not sure how I'm gonna do that, but it's fine. I want to work on last costume, which is the aerial costume. Well, Fun fact, the third costume for our D23 trip is going to be Ariel, and we want to do live action Ariel. Originally, I really wanted to do pink dress live action Ariel. It seemed really complicated, like I could not find anything remotely close to what I would need to make this dress. All the cosplay outfits that I saw just looked really like cheap looking and like costumey like and I wanted it to look like her actual outfit and, and I had all these ideas of how I could make potentially make this dress but it honestly felt really complex and not that I don't believe in my abilities I just don't believe in my abilities with five days before I leave you know what I mean like we just don't have time to be testing the abilities in this moment. Me and Lauren have done Ariel and Vanessa before, but kind of like toned down, just more casual. And I want it to feel more costume-like because our other two outfits are a little bit more toned down and casual. So we're doing blue dress Ariel. I ordered a skirt, a top, and a corset. I could not find a light blue corset literally anywhere. I don't understand how that's even possible. Like, the only thing I could find was a white one and we're gonna dye it. Mm, yeah, I'm nervous. I do have a couple of PR boxes that I want to open and then we're gonna open the Ariel outfit and see what it looks like. This one is from Too Faced. Too Faced little card. We have another waterproof mascara. I'm so excited because I feel like they send it always at a perfect time when I'm running out. Their lip injection. Oh, I don't think I have this color like a purpley one. These are like really, really strong. Like I think these are like my least favorite lip plumping glosses that they have. They have another one um, and like one it's also prettier packaging, but I also think it's not as like, I wanna call it spicy, but it's not spicy, but like the lip plump glosses are tingly, if that makes sense. These are super tingly and it's a little bit much it says maximum plump so i don't really reach for these i reach for the other ones a little bit more but i do love this mascara I actually delivered to my neighbors and they came over and they were like girl this is not ours period um but this is from mobile bar oh okay they just came out with disney ears and they're pink i love pink oh they're like a purpley pink oh okay they're like reflective i don't know they look like mirrors or like um is it stained glass or like mosaic tiles i don't know they're super pretty it would be really cute for valentine's day they're more of like a fuchsia kind of color i would say super fun thank you so much bubble bar and Too faced the back is just plain last box that we have is from makeup eraser Ooh, okay loving all the pink packaging we have a makeup eraser which i'm not sure if i've ever used one but it is a seven day set erase all makeup with just water Oh, I have to try this. Wet, erase, and exfoliate. That's all you have to do is what it's saying. Have one for every single dwarf. That is so cute. Oh my gosh, which one is your favorite dwarf? I think mine is Dopey. I feel like Dopey's a lot of people's favorite. It's so, so cute. I do really love Dopey. Um, and then the other one that I really love is Bashful. So cute. And it comes with a little 
laundry bags. Open up this package. So happy that it arrived on time. All this stuff is from Shein. First thing that we have is the top, which I already got the skirt. The skirt I got off of Amazon. Here is the top. Okay, I'm so glad it is a chiffon material because then I was looking at the photos online. It looked like it would be more of like a fabric-y. I don't know, I don't know fabrics, okay? But like a different material and this is what I wanted. Here is the top, so cute and I love the little ruffles. I do wish the ruffles were like a little bit more extra but like it's okay. We have the corset. This corset is just a white corset. I'm so nervous about dyeing this. Some dye on Amazon and I think we're gonna go outside right now after I change. I need to take off these clothes and wear something that I don't mind staining. The corsets that I saw were like corset tops or they were just like really like extra long kind of corsets if that makes sense. And so this is the only thing I could find that had a similar shape to hers that was white. And of course it still has like detailing, which we didn't really want, but we're gonna make this work. If you look really, really closely to Ariel's corset, she does have little flowers. So I got these on Shein, these are like a dollar. I'm just gonna glue these on because I don't know how to sew. I'm feeling much better about this costume because the top is like perfect. I just poured the blue dye and it's looking black and I'm really scared. This is the dye that I got. This does not look like that. I'm like really nervous that it's gonna be too dark, but we have to try it, I guess. I'm literally so scared. Oh my God. I think the dye is perfect. Oh my gosh, I got so lucky. I feel like it looks like the perfect shade of blue. So, so excited about this now. Oh my gosh, I was literally so stressed. I need to rinse it off with some water. Tomorrow, I will add all the flowers to it. Just finished getting ready. Actually, this morning was the Love Shack Fancy X Stanley Cup drop. Everything sold out in like literally two minutes. So <laughs> um, I was able to get the main cup that I wanted. So I'm really excited for that to come in. And I'm so lucky because everything was sold out. Um, I did want one of the minis, but the minis were the first to go. So I'm glad that I still was able to at least get one cup. Because I mean, how many cups do you really need? We have a lot of prep to do today. Um, I'm so happy that the corset is looking so good. Like the color turned out perfectly and I'm just feeling so much better about it. Add the little flowers to it. I did order some pearls on Amazon. I was also thinking maybe adding some pearls on it. I'm not sure if I want to do that. I don't think hers has pearls, but just for like something extra, I don't know, we'll see. Also want to try on my outfits to meet Tiana. Also don't have any park outfits ready, so I need to figure out what park out outfits we're gonna bring. And yeah, I don't really wanna leave my house today. Like I need to get my nails done. I don't feel like leaving my house today. Like I literally just wanna stay home because I went to work yesterday. So I'm like, I just wanna rot in my house today. I'm gonna start with the corset um because i'm really excited to work on it I'm really hoping it turns out really cute how perfect is the color i am so proud of myself for picking the right shade because i really was doubting myself when it was like in the pot it looks so good i'm so excited the flowers are here I'll, like play around really quickly and figure out what the vibe is for this but I'm feeling really excited about this now and the pink flowers are gonna match the pink boots which I haven't even showed you guys yet. It's gonna be so cute, I'm so excited. I decided to keep the flowers all the way to the back to do the other side and then the top as well. is complete. 
complete and I'm obsessed with it. I was thinking of adding more flowers here, but I think it looks good enough just like this. I also put them on the back and now we're gonna try them on. I'm so excited, like my vision came to life. Still really wish that these little things weren't in the corset, but I think it's okay. I think it's looking really good. Now we're gonna try the costume on and hope that everything looks good. I literally haven't tried a single piece from this costume and we leave in two days. I don't know why I did this to myself, but clearly I have so much fun when I procrastinate. So I feel like I'm probably gonna get questions on my t-shirt. Bell and Park sent me a couple of their new pieces. They're a small shop and this is the t-shirt that I got. Um, I did do a full haul on TikTok. So if you guys have TikTok, you guys can watch that. But I have some sweatshirts. Um, I was actually wearing one of them earlier, but it got really hot and then I took it off. Um, but like... This is super cute. And then I also have a Tiana sweatshirt, which I think I'm gonna take on my trip because we're doing a lot of Tiana stuff on this trip. This is the top that we have. This I also, did I show you guys this? Yes, I think I showed you yesterday. Skirt is from Amazon. This is the only skirt I could find that had the uh, tears, like the ruffles that was like made out of tulle. Like, part of me is like, maybe I should have gotten one of those, like those things you put under the dresses to like make it look like a ball gown. I'm like, do I need that? I don't know if hers has that actually. So maybe it's okay. Look really closely, it has some polka dots. But I'm far away, like you can't tell. It's okay. So we're gonna try this on. I don't know if I should wear it on the shoulder or off the shoulder. Cause I feel like Ariel's is like slightly off the shoulder. Like it's more like this. So maybe if I just like hike this up, then that's kind of cute. Try the corset on. I'm so excited. I really hope this fits. Maybe I should have gone up a size. Oh, girl. I don't think it fits. Okay, maybe if I loosen the laces in the back. Come on. this fits it's just like really open in the back but no one's gonna look at the back so whatever okay good thank god that fit is this looking cute i can't tell ariel's headband is like a mauve color but i have this pink one and i feel like it matches the flowers a bit more and so i kind of want to do this color i obviously have my hair in a bun so you're not gonna be able to see the vision fully bought these pink shoes which are also from amazon so cute so ariel wears like sandals but then she also wears boots in some scenes so i thought the pink boots were just cuter for my vibe here it is with the hair down oh is it ariel i think it is i think overall this is the best costume that i have and we did it you guys and we have tomorrow left like i did this ahead of schedule usually i would be hot gluing things the morning of my flight and look at us go a couple days in advance okay period took my costume off because i feel like i can't breathe in that course i think i'm going to order a petticoat to put underneath the dress just to give it more volume and if you look at ariel's dress it is pretty full so i think i'm gonna order that now my concern is do i order it to my house or do I order it to the hotel we're staying at because I don't know if I can travel with that thing like is it gonna be too much for me to pack with me Ugh, I don't know I need to figure out what I'm doing I feel like in general my costumes aren't too big so it would just be that thing that would just take up a lot of room i also need to order lunch because i'm starving um i think i'm gonna order a sandwich my favorite sandwich spot place is called the sandwich spot i always get the same exact thing i get the smoking sequoia no mayonnaise with mustard i don't like mayonnaise um and then i always get a bag of salt and vinegar chips and a diet coke and i'm so excited for this to get to my house one thing that i hate about myself is i always come up with last minute ideas like literally three days before i'm leaving i'm like okay i need to do this outfit this outfit i have this idea like 
it's just so annoying um so here's one more idea that i want to add to my list of outfits that i'm already bringing they are doing a bluey and bingo meet and greet and bluey is one of lauren's favorite shows so we definitely need to meet them for her we we're originally trying to do like she was gonna dress as bluey i was gonna dress as bingo or like wear like bluey and bingo t-shirts but we didn't find any t-shirts that were cute for adults or even for kids um, that we liked so we're, we were just like gonna scrap the idea in total but then I remembered they have a dog in the show named Coco and she wears all pink and she has like a little butterfly clip in her hair so I am going to order a butterfly clip and then I'm just gonna throw something together that I already have at home so I'm adding that to my list of outfits that I don't need to be adding oh and then I also have the pearls these just came in I wanted to add these to my hair they're like stick on pearls that you can add to your hair I think I'm also gonna add them to the corset I think just like on the hot pink flowers I'm gonna add some pearls to it just to like add a little something make it a little bit more me even though hers doesn't have the pearls I think it'll be really cute to add just added the pearls and they're super small I just think they look really cute with really small pearls and I only put them on the hot pink flowers I just think it looks so much cuter like you won't be able to really tell unless you're up close but I just think the added detail is just I don't know it's just more beautiful to look at i guess really happy with how it turned out and it honestly only took me like five minutes to put them on because it does have like little adhesive because it's supposed to go in your hair I was filming a purchaser pass and i got kind of sleepy while filming so i decided to stop filming because i just felt like my energy was getting really low and i still feel like it's really low so i'm just like i don't know i feel like for those videos i need to be like energize and entertain i just feel really drained today um but for vlogs i don't really care if i'm tired <laughs> i decided that i wanted to try on my tiana outfit like my meeting anika outfit originally my plan was to wear these ears and it's still my plan i'm going to show you the dress that i have depending on what it looks like on i might just scrap this entire idea it was honestly so hard to find anything in this color i personally don't own a single thing in this army green color army green just like isn't a trending color right now because it's not fall yet i felt like it was just nearly impossible to find anything that i felt like was kind of cute I'm finding this dress which is from um addicted like a little bubble style which is really cute um and i'm hoping that it looks good on i was honestly really nervous that this was gonna look like trash baggy I don't know so i'm gonna try it on let's hope this works i do have another option if this doesn't work um but i just won't be able to wear these ears which i really wanted to wear them but maybe it's better that i don't wear the ears because it's not going to be at the park so maybe it's weird if i show up with ears i don't know but it's also like a disney convention and a disney brunch so like i don't i don't know let me just try this on here's what the dress looks like i do think it is the perfect shade um do I take my hair down again so we can see the vision? I don't think it's bad. I just don't know if I love it. Um, for shoes, I'm not sure what shoes yet. I do have these like ballet shoes. My other option is a completely different dress. It's just not going to match the ears, but I do think it's a really cute option for a brunch. This dress, which is actually from my collection with Wild Rena, I really wanted to save this dress for when the ride opens because if you look closely like the flowers match Tiana's outfit so well like Tiana's outfit on the ride it's like green and hot pink and I was like this would be so cute for when the ride opens but at this point who knows when the ride's gonna open this dress with these boots which are from Princess Polly it is a really good backup if I can't convince myself that though that dress is cute. It's so cute. Like I want to wear this to the ride opening day so bad. Just like not opening day, but just like the day that I get to ride it for the first time. I styled the dress and I think I've convinced myself that it's actually really cute. Now that I styled it on these like chunky earrings, I also added my little Tiana necklace. I will be adding my Tiana bracelet. I just didn't feel like dealing with it right now. Um, I'm also doing my pink stony clover bag with this little sorry the light is so bright but this little um keychain which i actually got from amazon for shoes i'm wearing these like ballet flats 
these ballet flats, which are from ASOS. I've been loving ASOS lately. I feel like they just have such cute stuff. Yo, I'm so excited. today also need to i have two broken ones so we just have to get them fixed i think i'm just gonna do not white but maybe like an off-white just like super natural looking natural looking um just because my outfits like there's so many colors like we're doing red we're doing blue i don't know what i'm wearing to the parks like i just want my nails to match everything maybe i'll do a couple like maybe like mickey rhinestones just to be a little bit more festive Okay, I don't understand what happened to these curls. These curls look great. What is happening over here? I don't know, and I just don't feel like putting in the time to make it look better. Maybe these will just fall later. My appointment is in an hour, so I'm gonna change, and then we'll go to the nail salon. Just changed. Um, I'm wearing, I think everything is from Princess Polly, um, this little like mermaid t-shirt, which I think is super cute. And then I'm wearing, I have on this little skirt from Princess Polly. My shoes are just like white sneakers from Amazon. They were like 20 bucks, which we love. Much everyday jewelry, this is Wild Rena. This is Pandora. This bracelet, my aunt actually gave this to me and I've been wearing this every single day. It's so pretty. It's just like super simple, which I love. Um, and then gold hoops as always. home from the nail salon it's already four o'clock it's 3 45 that's a day gone i feel like i've done literally nothing only thing i got done today <laughs> so far are my nails so here's what we ended up doing let me set you down ended up doing blue chrome you know blue is in spirit of d23 and ariel blue tiana's dress we're also doing blue and Ingram convinced me that blue is good because stitch for Lilo and Stitch. I don't know. It's going to clash with my dress, but it's fine. We did white chrome and then I added um, like rhinestone Mickeys on my ring fingers. And they'll be fun for the weekend and end of summer. I feel like they're like very mermaidy kind of vibe. Um, I ended up getting sushi um, for lunch i guess my first meal of the day after sushi i like really had a craving for boba i feel like i usually do anytime i have sushi i'm like i just need a boba right now as a little dessert there's kind of a lot of people there it's really hot today so there's kind of a lot of people so i was like mm, i don't think i want to wait i need to get home but i remember I do have an olipop in my fridge and i've never tried the barbie flavor i'm excited to try it it's the peaches and cream i'm really nervous I only had olipop i think once before and i remember not really liking it because it doesn't have a lot of like carbonation in it and i like my crispy drinks okay so um that's like my favorite part about sodas is just like the crispiness and like the bubbliness weird we would try it it's good i think my overall reaction is i wish that i had more carb carbonation which is definitely what i thought i was gonna say anyways um but the flavor is really good i'm actually gonna end today's vlog here i just need to like finish packing for the rest of the night figure out my outfits i feel like there's clothes that i'm like looking for and i can't even find them like there's just so much going on so i'm gonna end today's vlog here um i love you guys so much thank you guys so much for watching make sure you subscribe so you don't miss the d23 vlogs. so excited to bring you guys along we're gonna have such a great time i can't wait Okay, love you. Bye.